Hey guys, this is Michelo here again with another episode of Life and Drawing with Michelo. I'm hitting the start button. We all know what that means. It's 12 minutes to draw and chat with you guys. And so, uh, for this, and I'm going to try to <laughs> keep drawing. I don't know what I'm going to draw. I'm just going to draw something. Um, let me make sure that I have my right. Oh, we have 15. That's a little bit too, too much. So, yeah, so this, this episode, I'm going to focus on. I hate saying focus. I, but I just want to talk about wearing masks. And, you know, everybody have their own. And just a heads up. You know, it's 7.29 p.m. I usually try to record when everyone's asleep. But I will be, um, I'm planning on feeding um, our little one. I think it's three weeks now at around nine. And so I just don't, yeah, so that's why I'm recording earlier. So if you hear ambient noises in the background, it could be our three-year-old and our three-week-old <laughs> chiming in, you know. So, uh, so just just a heads up on that. So, and if you don't hear anything, then that means I uh, scrapped this <laughs> recording and did another one. <laughs> so, um, all right, back to the show. So yeah, uh, wearing a mask, you know, just wear. Where are you on the mask situation? And initially, when it was a a preliminary mandate suggestion to to wear a mask, um, uh, I wasn't. You know, I was like, ah, you know, wearing a mask is just not for me. Um, you know, I was like, why? I do have to wear a mask. Really don't want to wear a mask. Um, and and honestly, for certain practical reasons, um, particularly at work, you know, you know, you're moving around and type of work I do. Um, you know, it can be physical and um, laborious uh, at times. And so, so I'm breathing heavy, and and it's just. <clears throat> You know, having something over your face, over your nostrils. Um, even when I'm mowing our lawn and, you know, I have dust allergies and stuff like that. Um, just from, you know, from years of bronchitis and such. So it it can be a pain. And so, uh, so yeah, so even when I'm mowing, it's just some, many times I don't, I don't do it. And I just suffer afterwards because it's just hard to breathe while I'm sweating and and you know my my uh, my heart rate is up and and so um, so anyway so that was one of the main reasons why I'm like uh, I don't know feeling this mask thing and I understand the meaning and precaution uh, behind it you know so but anyway but then after a while you know. As things continue to progress, and um, you know, I just felt convicted at one point, and and I was like, you know what? It's not gonna kill me to wear a mask. <laughs> you know, I was just like, it's not gonna kill me to wear a mask. Just just wear the mask. Um, so I really felt convicted by the spirit, just to you know, wear the mask where it's mandatory. Or even just where it's highly suggested, because again, this was before it was mandatory um, um, in food stores, uh, um, even at you know your workplace and stuff like that. And and I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna I'm just gonna do it. You know, I just feel the spirit is like, hey, just just do it. Be the stronger brother, um, and and do it. It's not gonna. When I say be the stronger brother, it's not like oh people are weak who are choosing to wear a mask. It's just understanding 
the freedom that I have to not wear it, but yet having the wisdom to see that it's not going to kill me to wear it. And, it. and it may just ease the the, uh, the trepidation and the concern of someone else um, who uh, who I'm becoming contact with, you know, and so and so, and that's why I decided to um, just to, to just go ahead and just just wear the mask, you know, and so and that's what I do now. I just wear the mask. I'm going to Walmart. I wear it. Um, any other food store. Kroger, I wear it, uh, definitely medical places, I wear it, and even at work now, I don't wear it all the time, but if I'm going to be in uh, just close proximity of other folks, um, I just, you know, I'm like, I'm just going to wear it, you know, I don't particularly like it, but, you know, <clears throat> yet again, it's not, you know, it's not hurting me, um, well, you know, not majorly to wear it, it's not a, um, it's not an offense to my, uh, religious beliefs, you know, um, I'm not having to denounce my faith, um, when wearing it. And so if it ever came to that point, then you better believe <laughs> um, I won't be wearing it. <laughs> so, so we're not there, you know, we're not there. And, and so I've just, you know, purpose to, to oblige during this season of time to, to, to not wear it. And, and I mean, to wear it and, and so and that way, you know, my, my spirit is at ease. I don't feel a certain kind of way. I'm not walking in stores and contemplating, oh, what is this person saying? Or what are they thinking? Are they thinking I'm just being rebellious and I'm just, you know, I don't care. Uh, and I really, usually don't really care about what people think, you know. So, so, so I just allowed the spirit to... Uh, just to, to lead and, and guide me in that, in that fashion. And so, um, I know I said I was gonna, I wanna finish <laughs> uh, these drawings that I start. Um, I just don't know how realistic that is. And so, I'm gonna plan to do like a watercolor. Um, it'll be different, uh, because this is all digital. Watercolor will be traditional. And and it'll and it'll most likely be shot from my cell phone, and so it just may be a different uh, a different presentation. I got about three minutes and thirty seconds left. Um, so yeah, so so what are your thoughts? How do you feel about the mask? Are you wearing the mask? Are you not wearing the mask? You know, what are your thoughts? You know, how do you feel about it? You know, do you feel like it's a government thing? And I don't necessarily want to get crazy political but it's kind of hard not to um you know so what are your thoughts and then and then even beyond just thoughts about wearing a mask um you know just going deeper into um you know you know how can you use it as a testimony to wear the mask and and you know just considering others beyond yourself um you know, uh, you know, just what are your thoughts about that? And, and, you know, that, that, that takes a lot to, to recognize that, Hey, you know, I may not like this certain thing. And again, particularly if it's not going against any of your core values. Um, but I see what, I see that me just simply, simply, you know, um, obliging and extending some consideration how that helps um, 
folks who you know who may be struggling with a certain situation and so and in this case it'll be oh, folks need to wear a mask why aren't anyone wearing a mask and stuff like that and so um so yeah you know uh sometimes it's just important to you know just to uh consider others beyond yourself and 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 just see how you know your decision can impact uh, just someone's mindset and um, and they're all and their and their continents you know and so and sometimes we you gotta just consider that now you may hear a buzzer at some point and that will be the time time for me to to end uh, the show um, but yeah so my thoughts on the mask are you know it's not gonna physically harm you from wearing it you know just cons you know consider that you know and um, and not wear it because you feel pressure to, but uh, but just wear it, you know. See see how you're being convicted and led, you know. And if you if you're completely led to not wear it and, and you feel fine, then hey, so be it. Um, but if it's something where you're like ah, I don't know, you just feel convicted or you feel a certain kind of way. You know, maybe, you know, maybe that's just the spirit saying, why not wear it? <laughs> you know, it's not going to hurt you. It's not going to kill you. Oh, there we go. That's 12 minutes. Man, it comes, <laughs> it comes so fast. So, um, I was just trying to draw like a mystical creature here. <laughs> um, and so... Uh, yeah, uh, now see, I feel I I want I want to continue <laughs> I want to continue this, but um, I don't know maybe maybe I'll leave this like this and then for the next episode just continue with throwing on some colors, but you know it's an, it's an episode a week and I don't know I'm just gonna keep it fresh you know because each episode is gonna be a fresh topic. And um, yeah, and so for now, it's just supposed to be some caves and stuff like that. But the most important thing was just talking about masks. Uh, and are you wearing masks? Uh, do you hate it? Uh, uh, are you a proponent for it? And are you reluctantly <laughs> wearing it? Or are you noticing that, hey, I'm just going to oblige. Um, folks are gonna be made comfortable and it's not hurting me and so why not so yeah so just some things to consider uh, during these times and um, yeah just take a time take a time to consider that and um, use that same mindset for other things um, uh, particularly other uh, what's the word polarizing things um, just take the time to see it from someone else's point of view and you know it helps to open up your our eyes uh, when we do that and and we're not too self-centered uh, but we're <clears throat> contemplating and and having a perspective from the other point of view uh, I think the more we do that the more we'll begin to uh, establish common ground, and so, and I know I could have continued. Being, I could have, I could have been drawing at this point in time. It's so hard to find that balance of just <laughs> drawing and then talking, and not just talking and not drawing and not just drawing and not talking. So anyway, episode two of oh, there's some echo. I think I have my gain too high. Sorry about that, guys. But this has been episode two podcasts life 
and drawing with uh, Michelle Lolly. Thanks again. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe um, uh, to my YouTube channel, uh, Facebook as well. Uh, it's facebook.com at Michelle Comics. And you can support me also at patreon.com uh, forward slash Michelle Lolly. All right, guys, thanks a lot again for your time. And until next time, grace and peace.